Holy cow. Look at that. The worst fear is that there's a dead body in here. You can barely see. So you can see that this yard is severely overgrown. And what had happened is a previous lawn care company kind of kept shrinking the yard. And so there were sticks everywhere, there was brush everywhere. But we were shocked to find a red Dodge pickup. And all I could think of is I hope there's not a dead body sitting in this thing. So I think what we'll do is we'll actually start on this side, try to clean this up. I brought the weed whacker. Cause I don't want to just mow over everything. So I brought the weed whacker to get back in there. Then we can mow it, trim it, but we'll see how far we get tonight. We get a lot of questions from uh, all of our fans and our viewers on, Eric, you know what kind of trimmer do you use? And we use a steel trimmer, it's amazing. But the biggest thing is we use the .105 uh, trimmer line, which you need a powerful head to be able to cut through stuff. But this thing is nothing short of amazing. I didn't want to get too close to the truck with uh, the weed eater, so what I did here is I, I did grab the hedge trimmers just to kind of cut back some of the bigger stuff. Worked pretty good. I think in the back I had to get the chainsaw out, and here I'm just trimming around. And you'll see once I get to the other side, there's another surprise. It is crazy what we found in this yard, literally just sitting idle, not being used. Like this truck is pretty clean for sitting here for 10 years. It makes you wonder, why aren't they driving it? Thank goodness there's no one in the truck besides a cup. The other thing we did worry about is this being stolen, but it appears in talking to the owners that it's definitely not stolen. It's just been sitting here for 10 years. Looks like a perfectly good truck. Would you let this sit out for 10 years on the brush?
Never in my life would I imagine I'd find a Dodge pickup buried in the yard, yet alone a boat. I can only imagine what else we'll find as we finish this yard. And believe it or not, there is actually a trailer underneath this boat. So crazy. And what else did we find? We found a bunch of wood buried under this grass, but not just wood. There is a fire pit underneath here, believe it or not. So here we broke out the push mower, just trimming out along here, cutting this a little shorter by the truck, and I will let you enjoy the beautiful sounds of this mower. This is such an amazing transformation seeing a truck in a boat, but I could not believe that this lady was so stunned. Such a beautiful family, and I'm so thankful to help them. I've hmm. never seen this this clear before. Yeah. Ever. We trimmed oh. some of it down, cut a couple trees. We got more in there to get. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to get going, and we'll be back. Thank you so much. No problem.